so cryoglobulinemia is one of these topics that most physicians will come across somewhere along the line. It sort of creeps up on patients and doctors. Um, it's chronic. Uh, it can come and go in terms of clinical symptoms. It's obviously exacerbated by the cold. And one of the biggest challenges with cryoglobulinemia is testing for it. It needs very careful handling because you've got to keep samples warm until they are um, separated in the laboratory. And that often derails the whole project, to be honest. So I think there are some, still some very basic issues in regards to cryoglobulin testing, uh, but it is a, a condition that is more prevalent than we think, I think, I believe. And I do think it causes a considerable morbidity for patients. So I think as doctors, we need to seek it out more often. We need to make, um, not make light of certain symptoms that we may see in patients. But in the context of particularly IgM, paraproteinemic situations, think about cryoglobulin. Could this be there? Look for it because if you do treat patients and plasma exchange is a good way of testing whether you need to deplete the IgM, patients can actually feel a lot better for it.